black history figures you've never heard of. At 13, Gwendolyn Brooks published her first poem in American Childhood magazine. By 16, she already had 75 poems published. By the time she graduated from high school, she was a regular contributor to African-American newspaper Chicago Defender. At 28, she published A Street in Bronzeville, her first book of poetry. Her second book of poetry, Annie Allen, was published four years later. She would receive a Pulitzer Prize for that book in 1950, making her the first African-American to win a Pulitzer.